Got up at five, just absolutely pumped for the day. Um, I think the rest of the shoot's gonna go good. I think, uh, I have faith, he's gonna catch a fish. He hasn't done it so far, but he's, he's gonna do it. It's Josh is red, making me feel like a, a little puny guy over here with my scarlet, but is what it is. A couple drone shots, but the sun flares. What about that one top down I got a bigger lens, so like, you know. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, my hand is so strong. Hey, he's got one. Shooting a lot of slow mo today, trying to get them nice splashes. Getting the bass going, and then a wide shot of just him in the middle of the pond. That would be cool. Um, did you see the slow. drone shot that I was wanting earlier, or not earlier, but whenever we do the drone? I also could the go, top I could down. Down. Yeah. yeah. Now it's getting hot. I might take my jacket off. How long will the snorri cam take to get Super set up? Fast. It is it. This is kind of whack. What? What's wrong with it? It's actually nothing's wrong with it, but okay, that's kind of cool. <laughs> I guess. I mean, yeah, I can make it work. Okay. And I can always fish one-handed too if I need to. Or Two hours in the shoot, feeling good. This is a pretty sick shoot. Gosh, dude, what is wrong with me? Oh man, <laughs> even on set, I can't talk in front of the camera. <laughs> this is weird having cameras on me all the time. I'm not used to this. I'm pretty versatile on my shot because I can kind of zoom in, so I guess it's more dependent on. Josh's wideness. Get closer to him so we don't smack the tree. Turn around this way. Like which way we're, are we we're, This shot. Um, we're. This is we're tracking him. Yeah. With it. With him. Um, we're gonna go out wide and come into him. Oh, so he's I, going this way. Yeah, just going. Dude, I've only, I'm, I'm like nervous because like I've flown a drone for like 10 years now and Never hit I crashed the drone on our climbing shoot. I ran I right into the, the freaking wall and I'm like, I know that there's a giant frick like rock wall right there and I still just, because there's no side sensors on these. Oh yeah. And I was going sideways like that and I just like, doof. 
hit yeah, it. Yeah, you have to have a spotter. I just wasn't. I, I honestly it was just like my idiot brain. I was I wasn't even looking at like the camera. I was looking at the drone, and I was like, and I just flew right into that wall. And ever since then, I've been like a lot more cautious, which is a good thing I learned. Thank you guys for watching that video. This was a project we did for a local tourism bureau. We had a small crew of four, a DP, a camera operator, the director, and an AC. Uh, Camera-wise, we used uh, red cameras, the Red Ranger Monstro and a Red Dragon. And then in pre-production, we had a mood board and a shot list made just so on set we had a rough idea of what we wanted to get. The story was about this college fisherman and just kind of his story on fishing as well as highlighting some local fishing spots around the area. Uh, if you like this behind the scenes or want any other kind of videos about camera gear, you know, running a production company, subscribe to this channel, like this video. I think that's it. Peace.